Hi, this is Rick uh, with Utility Composites. Want to give you a real quick uh, demonstration of the Sundog RFID system. Um, of course, we've got the Sundog RFID staples here. They come in a collated strip, which really makes it easy to uh, uh, fast, you know, quickly install these in numerous pieces of wood at one time. You don't have to do a whole lot of loading and reloading of your, of your tool. We have our tool here, our pneumatic tool. It's uh, connected to an air compressor. Ideally, you want to have this set at about a 90 PSI, but it's going to depend on the, the type of wood you're going into as the, how much pressure you need to have in there. So uh, right now we have it set at 90 PSI. I've got a couple of staples already in here, but I want to pop a couple more in here so you can kind of see how it works. Um, we also have a manual tool, so there's some applications that don't require this, or maybe you don't have air on your yard. You can use the manual hammer tacker to, to, uh, to apply these in the, in the appropriate piece of wood as well. So why not, I'll just uh, I'll fire a couple in here so you can kind of get a look at it. And as you can see, we put them in here. They're really sturdy and securely attached. They're not coming out. You could pick this log up with them that quick. It bonds with that wood. You do want to make sure that the antennas are separated. This is makes it more optimized so that when you go back to read it with your scanner, uh, you can read it from a greater distance when they're like that. If the, if the wires happen to be crossed, that's gonna cause some interference, but you do want them to be separated like that. And um, next, what we'll do is we'll, uh, we'll pull out the scanner, go and scan these and, and show you what they look like and how quickly you can, uh, you can scan these from a distance of up to 30 feet. Okay, so now we're about 10, 12 feet away from our, our log. You can go out much further, but for this demo's sake, we're about 10 or 12 feet away. And we've got, uh, we've got nine tags popped in the log there. So now we'll go to reading them with our scanner. This is a linear scanner. So it's ideally best when you're pointing right at a specific uh, RFID tag. Um, and as you go through and kind of circle around whatever the area is where your tags are, they'll come up and populate on the screen here. Uh, and we'll show you right now, we've got all nine tags showing from this reading. As you can see, those are the nine tags that we just scanned right there. Uh, the natural step from this point forward would be after you accumulated all the, data, all the tags on your scanner is to basically go back and start entering unique characteristics about your particular uh, log or load of wood and, and all the details that you need to know about that for your inventory system. So um, we'll show you here in, in, a, in a second how we go about doing that with this particular program. Uh, but the idea here is just to see you've got nine uh, tags in the log and we're able to see all nine of them. And in fact, one of the tags had one of the antennas broken off of it and we're still able to read it from this distance as well. So uh, just goes to show you the, uh, the flexibility, the durability of those tags and being able to be read from a, from a long distance.